Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, subscribe to the Diva Squad. Let's get started, you guys. OMG, you guys. I haven't done a video in like, well, like sit down video, just like me chatting, talking about stuff, showing things. There we go. In like forever. It's been like so long. Months. Like, I've just been doing a lot of like handheld, you know, like hold the camera, talk about drama or like vlogs or whatever. So I wanted to do a couple old fashioned Michaela videos and just like chit 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 with you, chit chat with you and um, show you my favorite products of the month. So I'm doing three videos tonight. I'm doing this video, which is, um, my earphones are here for some reason, um, a June favorites. I know June's over already. Crazy, right? July 4th. Here we come. I'm excited. Can you believe July 4th is Sunday? It's crazy. Anyway, less than a week away. Um... Yeah, I'm ready for the 4th. I have plans. Do you have plans for the 4th? This is the first time in years I actually have proper plans for the 4th. It's crazy. But anyway, you guys, so subscribe if you're new. Let's get started. So I have my favorites. I would have had more, but I'm doing a huge, like, what's in my beach bag video. Right? Fine. I've done that in years. So I'm not even going to sneak peek it for you guys. You have to just watch that video. My beach bag is so cute. And I just want to show you what I have in my beach bag. Super cute. So I'm going to show you my beach bag. So I got so many compliments, and I'm gonna show you like what I pack in my beach bag, and that actually goes into my first favorite, which is Slitterbond. So if you live in Galveston, Texas, well, I live in Houston, which is near Galveston. If you live in the Houston area, you or Texas, you know what Galveston, Texas is. It's a it's a big city, um, like driving distance from Houston. <clears throat> Excuse me, all my nails too, but don't talk about nails in a minute. But it's a water park in Galveston, Texas, and it, it had so much fun. Me and Galen went this weekend. It was so much fun this past weekend, and. Um, it was so much fun. I, I haven't been to a water park in so long, and I'm scared of heights. So I went on two huge rides, like the slides. I was freaked out, but it was so much fun. I was scared. I was low-key kind of scared. I was like, ah! So I closed my eyes in the ride. I was such a mess. But it was fun. And of course, Lazy River, I had so much fun. The white water raft, and it was, oh, It was fun. I haven't been in so long, and like, I haven't been to oh, Well, okay, I haven't been to Cinderbox since I was like nine years old. Yeah, so it's been forever. I wanted to go back. I'm gonna go back. If not this summer, the next summer for sure. And uh, anyway, so Slitter Bond is definitely my favorite. If the lights are flickering, okay, I have this new AC unit in my room. <clears throat> Keeps me really cool for the summer, but it's loud as and it when it like it turns like when it like it vibrates, the lights flicker. It's like a haunted house. It's crazy. Um, just kidding. Or kinda. Um, there's like spirits in my room. Ooh, just kidding. Um, okay, so now my next favorite is um these nails. Okay, so I get so many compliments on everything all the time. But those shirts from Target, it's men's. Um, and it's like a couple years back. So you know. But these nails are so cute. I get so many compliments on these like nails, especially this design here. This is my favorite design on oh, my boyfriend loves this design. My, my boyfriend's favorite design on me, I should say. No design on me, and it's so pretty. So, it's from the Kiss Salon. Um, it looks like this. And I always bring this with, like, glue. Nail glue, and if and one pops off, just glue it back on. And I have, like, you know, extras. So, I'm always good to go. Always put this in my purse. I'm actually gonna put this in my beach bag, because... Or forget because that's gonna go in that beach bag video too. So I'm gonna put I'm gonna put a 90s tag too coming up tonight. So I'm gonna put either one either one video up a day or I'm gonna put them all in one night. I haven't decided. Maybe like one each day. We'll see. Anyway, um, okay. So now for the lips, you guys. You probably wondering what's in your lips, girl. Aren't they pretty? Of course, Jeffy Star uh, Liquid Lip in the shade Tasty. Tasty, tasty. Is that focusing? Hopefully it is. Okay, whatever. It's that, and it's so pretty. Like, let me put some on here. It's so pretty. Oh. Oh my god. It is so pretty. Oh my god. Oh, obsessed. And the eyes, but my eyebrows have never looked better. I'm getting so good at doing my eyebrows freehand now. It's actually ridiculous. Obsessed. Okay, so of course, oh my god, the fuck proof mascara from Ruby Star. Oh my god. Okay, so by the way, I only do my top lashes now. And I've been not really liking doing um, eyeliner now. And I've been loving the eyeliner free look. Just doing the eyeshadow and the top lashes with the mascara, and that's it. I don't even do eyeliner right now, and I love it. Just like, it makes you look more like, like I don't know, it's like more, it's like less harsh. And I also want to do eyeliner in the bottom. My eyes get super red, so. 
Anyway, so I did this for the um, for the top. I love it. It's this isn't clump. You can layer it. It's like my favorite mascara right now. It's amazing. The other mascaras I always talked about are really really good. Like the fetish by um, I forgot their name and names, but the, the fetish eyes by Pat McGrath. Yeah, and then the other one I always use. I forgot. Oh, I remember they're like irrelevant now. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Those are good, but those get a little clumpy, which I kind of like a little bit. But this is like more lightweight and good for like summer. It's like a subtle lash, but so pretty. <laughs> Highlight is um, King Tut, a little bit of Ceracopicus mixed in by Jeffy Star, and it's um, oh my god, I don't know right, blinding. And I put a little bit of this eyeshadow here on my nose too. Okay, um, which I'll show you then. And it's blood money, you guys. Oh my god. You guys, the Jeffree Star is like evil incarnate, but his makeup is so good. So, I said his makeup. Him? No. His makeup? Yes. Okay. So, blood money. So, I'm using on my lid, I'm using um, tax free because I love it when things are tax free. And then the crease, I'm using equity, which I love. Crease and outer V up at the bottom as well. And then in the inner corner, I'm using. Divine Intervention, Obsessed. And then from the Orgy palette, I'm using, I think it's called, maybe it's in text free. I forgot what it's called. Oh, sorry, it's like all the way over there. Should I go get it for you guys? I'm not wearing any pants, just TMI, but I'm saying, yeah. It's another thing. I don't wear pants anymore inside the house. I just wear like undies and I wear my shirt. So it's kind of like a summer party, like all day long. So if I get up, you'll see my, well, I guess I could get up in a way that you wouldn't see it. Will I? Is it worth even getting? Or do you even care? Okay, fine. Just give me like one second. You're just in my bed. Okay. I don't want to show you my bottoms. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh my god. I don't want you to see anything. Okay. Okay. Orgy palette. So good. So the, um, under the eyebrow, I'm using one of the shades in the Orgy palette, which you guys, his eyeshadow palettes are my favorite. Like, oh my god. Oh, love this. Okay. So much of my nails, too. I'm using Teach Me. Is it Teach Me? Yeah, teach me. Yeah. From the orgy palette. Where is it? Yeah, that one right there. Teach me! No, right there. It's so pretty. Yeah. Underneath the brow, and it's just so pretty. Of course, the two-face blush, I always use like glue one and lips, yeah. But it's just so pretty. That's my look how I look today. So, yeah. Okay. So, let's see. Okay, let's talk about palettes, you guys. Jawbreaker. I've been wanting to do like a colorful look. Okay, so I give, okay, Jawbreaker, when I first used it, I wasn't impressed. I was like, ew, what is this? But now I actually live for it. And, oh my God. When I want to do a colorful eye, I go for this or Thirsty. Mostly this. Oh my God. Oh, So good. Um, oh my god, like snack is so pretty, even as a highlight or inner corner color. That's like a little bit, like, yeah, but I barely touched it. But orange juice to blend everything and wet, cherry wet. Oh, Tasty's ear. That's the lipstick I'm wearing. So, you want to use my lipstick as an eyeshadow? You can use that. There we go. There you go. Um, oh my god, jawbreaker, snack. I mean, there's so many. The thought is so pretty. <laughs> But yeah, orange juice and cherry wet and raspberry, I think my favorite color so far. And what, fuck, I mean, they're all really good. <laughs> okay, they're all so pretty. But anyway, for summer, they're all really good. So I'm literally, need to get every single one. Obsessed.org. Jawbreaker. If you don't have it, get it. So good. Okay, so what else do we have? There's so much stuff here, oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my god, this powder is like amazing. By the way, I'm not even using face primer anymore. I feel like it doesn't even work. So why am I bothering to use it? <laughs> Literally. I do get a little oily, but I just... Oh. With the Jeffree Star Banana Powder. The Magic Powder. I just use this. It smells like cotton candy. It's amazing. I just take the, um, this like little brush. This is like, I think BH Cosmetics Foundation Brush. I just like dip it in the powder, I just put it like where I'm oily, like side of my nose, T-zone, a little bit there. And then maybe like once a day and I'm good. Yeah, like I've had this makeup on for like, no joke, maybe like almost nine hours. And it literally looks amazing. I've had to like blot, blot, yeah, one time, but it's like, after that's like it, after eight hours, like come on now. Yeah, like before I filmed this video, like yeah. So it's amazing, get that, and it's been a, been a, been a 
that's the banana powder. So, okay, speaking of bananas, you guys, did you know, fun fact, I'm actually allergic to bananas. Yeah. So, I can have them a little bit, but not like a lot. So, you know how I, how I rediscovered it? Okay, so, Smoothie King. Oh, my God. This is a favorite, but kind of not there. This, this is like a, like a almost favorite because I love it so much, but it makes me, like, my face tingle because, like, when I have too much banana, it makes my face tingle. I know, kind of serious, right? So, I had this addiction the last month and a half. I've had, like, a smoothie from Smoothie King, like, every other day for the last week and a half. And I was like, oh, my God. Like, first it was, like, once a week. Then it was twice a week. Then it was, like, every other day. I was like, oh, my God. I have to get a Smoothie King. Like, then, uh, okay, it's called, excuse me. I'm getting all excited for Smoothie King. Um, it's called Caribbean Way. Oh, my God. I used to drink it all the time back in the day. And I recently um, got back into it. Oh, my God. It's literally all I drank for, like, the last two weeks. And, like, my face started tingling. I was like, why is it tingling? And it was because of the banana. So, if you, if banana doesn't give you problems, do that. And go on Fridays, because Smoothie King has their $5, 32 ounce medium, yeah, smoothies for only five bucks, so get that. Anyway, next thing is this deodorant. <laughs> so, it's unscented, but it still smells really good, though. Like, just like a regular clean scent. And, like, it doesn't... I have to use unscented because I get allergies really easily, you guys know, with things like that. So, um, under hammer, under hammer? Ew. Arm and Hammer, and this is 48 hours ultra, stay ultra fresh for 48 hours. I'm like, bam! Um, not sponsored, but you know, like I always say, wish I was. Um, yeah, Walmart, you know how it is. Walmart sponsorship, if, if one day they will sponsor me, I'll be so happy because I need it. What is this? Oh, this is for the Blood Money palette. A oh, little paper that goes in it. Oh, his palettes are so pretty. The packaging is gorgeous. Yes, I keep the little plastic things because... I just do it. Okay, we're good to go. Um, but yeah, clean and clear. I think I didn't show this last time. I don't know. But, um, yeah. So I don't even use, like, regular soap anymore. From Bath and Body Works, I use, like, the bar soap. But then, like, for face, I use bar soap sometimes. And I use this every single day when I wash my face. Um, it's just, like, a clean and clear. It doesn't have the little bubble things anymore. Well, not as many. Like the beads. Um... Just, that's what I use. I don't really have, like, a massive skincare routine. I just use that every day, and that's it. And I still use the Clean and Clear Night one. If I, that's when I'm, at night when I wash my face off after the makeup. Yeah, okay. Um, what else? This necklace is so cute. I'm, like, going back and forth with different things. But this, I got from Dave and & Buster's. And it's one of the little prizes we won. This is winner on it. This is a cute little piece to, like, layer with or just wear it by its, by its own. Yeah. And it's just so pretty. It just says winner on it. Because we're all winners in life, right? Right. Okay. Okay, Bath & Body Works. I thought I had something Bath & Body Works in this video. So, this is the Break Off Con. I just started using it literally last week. But, oh my god. It literally smells like... Okay, I'm not gonna lie. It smells similar to that... Oh, what's it called? One that came out a couple years ago. The one that I... Oh, that blueberry one that came out a couple years ago. I forgot now. Anyway, it smells like that. Um, in the Christmas collection, I forgot what it's called. Oh my god, is it blueberry cheese? No, whatever. Oh my god, I forgot. Whatever, you know what I mean, right? The one 2019, the, the, anyway, you know what I mean. The blueberry one. It smells like that, but a little bit different. Actually, now that I think about it, maybe it's just a dupe. <laughs> I don't know, actually it's pretty similar, whatever. Anyway, I just bought it, so it's good. Um, berry waffle cone. Keynotes are sweet summer berries, golden waffle cone, cream and vanilla. It's pretty good, get it, or whatever. If you don't, don't, but you should, okay. Um, okay, speaking of sweets, oh my god, you guys. I can't go a single day without eating a strawberry Pop-Tart. I don't know what it is. Like, these are so good. I put them in the microwave for like 30 seconds, unwrapped on a paper plate. Oh my god, they're like gooey and soft and so good. Oh my god, love it. Okay. So yeah, okay. Oh my god, speaking of banana. Okay, so I don't do real banana, but artificial banana I can do. And this is the banana life of taffy, you guys. The Dollar Tree has banana laffy taffy. Like that song, shake your laffy taffy, uh, laffy taffy, uh. Like, it's so good. Okay, a dollar for a packet of these. And how many come in here? I don't even know. Is it the same? I don't 
Oh my god, it looks like this. It's so good. Oh my god. If you like banana flavored anything, get it. And it's limited edition, so what supplies last? Dollar Tree, hello? Hold it in my huge Dollar Tree. I feel like Willy Wonka exploded in my last Dollar Tree. I think it was my last video, actually. Yeah, so check it out. And then the Haribu Watermelon Soft and Sweet Chews. Oh my god. They are shaped like little watermelons. Oh my god, they're so good. Dollar Tree as well. Okay, now this is not Dollar Tree. Now, like, my dad gets this from Kroger. Oh my god. ASMR. From Kroger. And it's like a local grocery store here in Texas. But, oh my god. They're the Crumb Delicious Peanut Butter Sandwich Cookies. They literally taste like Reese's Pieces. Buttercup. Like, oh my. <laughs> so if you live in Texas, like near Kroger, get these. Because you will, they taste like you're eating peanut butter jelly. Peanut butter jelly. Peanut butter, Reese's peanut butter cups. Yeah, it's okay. And I can't even have that anymore because it has dairy in it, but this is no dairy in it, so if you can have dairy and you miss and you miss and you miss peanut butter Reese's pieces, get this instead. I think it's even better. It's amazing. Yes, the AC comes off and on like that. It's really random. Okay. This is so good. Oh girl, this is so good. Okay. These random wipes. I don't know where my dad gets them though. Citrus fruit scent. It smells really good. I just use these wipes. I'm not gonna say what I use them for. But I use them to say fresh and clean. Wink, wink. So yeah. These are the wipes I use. And I forgot where he gets them from. I probably should have asked. Ooh, yeah. But they're bleach free and they come with 72 wet wipes. So yeah. And then last but not least, this. You guys know I have like. I have dandruff dry scalp issues, and this helps with it. It's a two-in-one everyday clean um, dandruff shampoo and conditioner, and it's comparable to the Head and Shoulders. Uh, it's like a generic brand, and I think it's from Walmart as well. And this is just really good. This is like good for like if you have sensitive scalp, dandruff issues, dry scalp issues, like I do. Use this, you're good to go. Okay, so I think that's it for that. Any songs? I don't think so. I mean, not like off the bat. And any movies? I don't really know. Oh, I saw Mortal Kombat. I actually didn't hate it. I thought it was kind of good, actually. It was like, okay. And then what else? Oh, I saw The Conjuring. Okay, so the first half was like really good. And the second half was a little bit of a drag and boring. But overall, it was pretty good. Better than I thought it was going to be. So, like, the, that one made me do it. The, the new one that came out, that was kind of good. And, oh my god, the Sweet Tart, um, Sweet Tart, Sweet Ropes, Rainbow. Oh my god, and the cherry, that candy, oh my god. I would show you any, but I had them all already. Um, I know, I'm, I've been, like, eating it up this past month, so, yeah, I think that's it, you guys. So yeah, I'm gonna film my What's My Beach Bag video, and then I'm gonna film my 90s tag, which will be clickbait at the house. So if I'm crying on the thumbnail, it's that video, click that. So anyway, it's coming up soon, very soon. Thanks for watching. If you made it through the video, thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, join the Diva Squad, and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Kisses. Until next time. Bye, guys.